Hey, Shalom, y'all, Sharala. This is Issachar coming back at you with a uh, brief update concerning a uh, prophecy entitled Bank of America, Customer Anxiety, and Test Runs for New Digital System. So, giving all praises to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Waraka Akwadash, double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, which are the men that taught me. The 100% truth according to the law and the testimony of the Heavenly Father. So again, okay, Bank of America. It says some Bank of America customers are reporting missing money. And uh, I was watching the uh, one of the uh, the the uh, brothers, okay, who uh, who teaches in uh, in, in Ka Kansas City. Okay, he went into a uh, matter of fact. Let me uh, pull his. Uh, this channel up for you brothers and um and sisters to subscribe so uh, in this channel okay um gm is a uh, kansas uh, city priests and uh he made a uh, part one and part two if you want to go ahead and subscribe it's entitled train runs of cbdc systems boa which is bank of america taking money out of customers Okay, um, give me a second, out of customers' accounts, and then, uh, part two, okay, still have to watch it, but, you know, I wanted to do, do this uh, video briefly, it says, tra trail runs for CBDC, or C CDBC systems, Bank of America says, CBDCs are the future of money and payments, so really what's going on with, uh, uh, with uh, customers' uh, funds, okay, um, and not just Bank of America, okay, you might have uh, Wells Fargo, okay, uh, Chase, uh, Navy Federal, okay, and these are uh, different uh, third-party agencies that are connected to, uh, you know, uh, these uh, banks, they are doing uh, what they call test runs, test runs where Esau Edom, okay, because Esau Edom, the, the so-called white man, he's the one behind, okay, these uh these uh, schemes and you know money missing. Okay, what these devils are doing, they are okay doing a, a test run. Matter of fact, let me type in test run right here. Okay, for for the brothers that don't know what it means, it says. A, an occurrence in which a product or procedure is tried in order to see if it works correctly. Trial run. They did a test run of the new software. See? And now you might be a, a, a customer from these uh, different bank, bank accounts. And you might get anxiety, man. Hey, what the heck is going on with my money? I mean, I had $10. Now I'm negative 100 You see? And I'm speaking about Jay because a lot of you Israelites, okay, pursuing to the... Um, the curses, okay, um, you know, the, the average Hebrew Israelite has, you know, $100 in their uh, bank account. You see, this is Baruch 3 and 8. Behold, we are yet this day in our captivity. You see, so still to this day, the year 2023, so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, hey, we're still in slavery under these uh, heathens, under these uh, other nations, under the so-called white men. Under the uh, so-called Chinese, under the uh, so-called uh, Arab, the so-called Japanese, okay, where Tho has scattered us, you see, because the uh, biggest bulk of Israelites, they were scattered, okay, primarily here in America, in Babylon the Great, for a reproach and a curse, and to be subject to what? To payments, according to all the iniquities of our fathers, which departed from the Lord our our God, Yahweh Shai. So still to this day, we're being uh, subject to payments. Okay. And um these are payments really okay if you own you know assets, okay, for you brothers that don't know what what an asset is, asset versus uh liability. Okay, it says assets are the items your company owns that can provide future economic benefit. Liability, liabilities are what you owe other parties. Okay, let me get examples. Okay, because you might be a brother that owns a uh, 
a, a vehicle, you might own a uh, a house. Okay. Okay, for uh, or, or you might own a, a very uh, precious. Okay, um, possession. Okay, but in reality, uh, it doesn't belong to you. Okay, it belongs to Esau because Job nine twenty four, the earth is given into the hands of the wicked. It says assets versus liability is the complete breakdown. And I'm just going to get straight to the point. It says um, assets, items, or resources of value that the business owns. Assets can generate revenue and provide long-term benefits to the owner. Example, property. Like, yeah, like like your home. Okay, your, uh, you know, acres, acres of land. You know, liabilities, it says, debts and business owes to another business, vendor, employee, lender. Okay. Um, it says, uh, items of value. That's what asset means. A items of value. Again, I give the example. You might have a very, uh, you know, uh, expensive painting, you know, as an asset, you know, which belong to, uh, you know, uh, an owner. Okay, um, years ago, but now you own it, but it has a lot of value. Okay, business owns the items, generates revenue for the business. Pretty much an asset is long term. Okay, uh, okay, a uh, long term uh, benefit. Okay, which liability would be like a, a short term. Okay, in other words, if I'm making sense, but you know, these are. Uh, these assets and liabilities that brothers and sisters have, okay, really, they all belong to Esau even because this is his uh, system. And what Esau's going to start doing, okay, if you have uh, might have money, funds in your uh, bank account, you might have these uh, different, okay, um, like I give the example, assets and liabilities. Well, Esau's ready to take that away from you Israelites, you see, and that's going to cost a lot of... Uh, like I uh, typed in the title, a lot of uh, customer customer anxiety. This is uh, Syrac for and want. Don't re don't deprive a poor person's life, and don't avoid looking the needy in the eyes, and don't make a person in dire straits angry. You see, because that's happening, man. Okay, um, you know, have a lot of uh, and not just and not just Jake, not not just your so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Okay, because we are under the curses, but what the Lord is uh, currently doing, pursuing to Deuteronomy, Deuteronomy uh, 30 and 7, the Lord is starting to put curses on these heathens. It says, And the Lord thy God, Yahweh Shai, will put all these curses upon thine enemies and on them that hate thee, which persecute thee. So these test runs are not just uh, being targeted on you Israelites, okay, but that they're targeting everybody now, okay. That that curse is being uh, lifted up. So again, some Bank of America customers are reporting missing money. It says some Bank of America customers are concerned after seeing money missing from their accounts Wednesday morning, according to social media posts. And there's a tweet from uh, Kiri Reen that says, Saw Bank of America was trending and turns out my account was impacted so happy Wednesday for everybody. Uh, I am at the point of collapse. Where is my money? You see, hey, uh, these uh, spirits, man, they're getting uh, active, man. You see, they're getting anxiety. Why? Because the Lord is starting to, uh, you know, put that 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 curse that we had once. Okay, now it's being uh, flip, flipped around. Okay, for you, uh, for you devils. This is Deuteronomy twenty-eight. Deuteronomy twenty-eight, and give me a second. Deuteronomy 28 and 23, a foreign nation you have never heard about will eat the crops you worked so hard to grow. You will suffer under cons constant oppression and harsh treatment. You see, because we're getting ready to, uh, um, you know, deal with uh, Jacob's trouble. And during Jacob's trouble, there, there will be a, an old time high, okay, uh, oppression and an old time high harsh treatment, okay, from Esau, Edom and the harsh treatment and uh, constant oppression there's a, a perfect example okay um working your ass off for you know overtime hours you see 16 17 hours a day 
working of uh, 50 to 70 hours a week okay just to uh you know try to enjoy your um uh, your 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 hard-earned money but then this devil he starts oppressing you he starts uh mistreating you okay by taking away okay the hard-earned money you know the uh, the money that you work for so hard and now he's transferring okay your own funds without your consent okay to these uh new uh digital systems you see which the digital system is going to be in the form of uh you know the uh, ai artificial intelligence okay uh starting with that that microchip which is the mark of the beast and without without that mark okay you cannot buy or sell see that so these are just test runs that are uh, currently ha happening that says some customers may have received a message in the bank of america app saying Zealot transactions from Saturday through Tuesday were delayed. The alert said the accounts would be updated as soon as possible, but did not specif specify when. It says that Bank of America said that they so-called apologize for any delay or inconvenience. Okay, let me get a precept. Okay, because when you so-called apologize, okay, you're... Uh, Okay, you're uh, actually giving peace to your to your neighbor, right? But this is Psalms 55, 21. The words of his mouth were smoother than butter. So there's an example of the words of their mouth being smooth as, bur uh, as butter. Saying that they apologize. Okay, sorry for the delay and the inconvenience. Because really these uh, these uh, systems of technology, they're actually owned by, by the devil himself. So if there's ever like a so-called glitch, you know, on the system, a glitch... Or, or what they call a bug really these are test runs okay by the devil himself because he's the one that holds that power okay he has the power to uh you know uh regulate or control you know technology man uh, on the left hand side it says the words of his mouth <coughs> were smoother than butter but war okay but in reality war was in his heart which is your mind his words were softer than oil yet they were drawn swords so really these apologies okay they they, they have no uh, real meaning because really this devil okay he's uh, ready to uh you know uh crash the society crash the uh this current system okay and uh and activate okay or uh, execute the uh, new digital system man it says um pix 11 reached out to bank of america for comment but did not immediately receive a response. So there you go, man. You know, these devils are getting ready, okay, to, uh, you know, start doing the uh, test runs for the uh, new digital system. And I believe they have before uh, 2030, okay, Agenda 2030. Uh, that's their deadline, okay, of uh, Esau Edom. Okay, uh, before that deadline, they need to have this whole uh, Babylonian system turn into a, a digital system. Say rag four and two, don't grieve a hungry person, don't trouble an angry person, and don't put off giving to the needy, and that's gonna happen, man. When uh, when all hell break loose, a lot of our people are gonna be um, okay in need, okay um, in need for uh you know food, cause when we see the uh um the food supplies, you know especially you know eggs, you know they're the the prices are inflating. Okay, they're they're now like uh, ten dollars for for twelve eggs. Okay, okay, and that's you know it's gonna start getting worse. Not just with the eggs, but you know all the resources, and a lot of our people are gonna be needy. Okay, because you know our people collectively, okay, uh, they're already poor. Okay, you know we're we're already poor. You know how much more when oil hill break loose, and be even more poor. Why? Because this devil is taking away your own uh, your own money and transferring it to a. Uh, to digital currency without your consent okay and a lot of uh, a lot of our, our people okay they're gonna have no other choice okay but to uh take that mark the mark of the beast and bow down to the system in order for them to uh buy sell you know in order for them to to eat you know to to stay active okay in this uh new babylonian system it says verse five don't turn your eyes away from someone begging and don't give anyone an opportunity to curse you you see that's gonna happen to a lot of uh a lot of our our people man when they will break loose and they're gonna be begging 
okay, to who to Esau, Edom, like it tells you in the curses, okay, uh, the one of all things. But if you're of the elect, you're catching hell, what's going to happen is that you're going to start cursing this devil, okay? And when you curse this devil, that's when Yahweh Bashim Yahshai is going to start making his moves. That's why here in Deuteronomy 30 and 7, it says, What the Lord thy God will put all these curses upon thine enemies and on them that hate thee, which persecute thee. So another form of uh, persecution and showing hate to uh, to an Israelite is by depriving them from their from their needs, okay? Their needs, you know, which which are uh, you know food resources, food, water, you know. Uh, matter of fact, let me get a uh, site rack thirty seven. Okay, let's get a uh, simple examples of what it means to uh, to have the uh, basics. It says. Sirach 37. Okay, Sirach 37. Let me see if I can find it. Should be Sirach 17. Okay, uh, principle food. Sirach 37, um, uh, 39 and 26. The principal things for the whole use of man, okay, which are your needs, are water, fire. Iron and salt, flour of wheat, honey, milk, and the blood of the grape, and oil and clothing. These are the needs, okay, of a, of a man's life. It says, verse 27, all these things are for, are for good to the godly. So to the sinners, they are turned into evil. You see that? So Esau's going to use the, uh, <clears throat> the principal things. Of a man's life and and turn it around. He's gonna you know start overcharging you for water, and not only does he overcharge you for water, but he adds fluoride in the water. He adds these different metals and chemicals to the water. Okay, he's gonna start using that 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 fire. Okay, uh, you might have a, uh, um, you know for uh, cooking essentials. Okay, your stove. He's gonna start turning down the electricity, uh, cyber attacks. Okay, your your iron. A lot of our people, uh, they suffer from uh, what is it? Uh, anemia. You know, uh, low uh, blood cell counts. Okay. Uh, salts, uh, sodium chloride, flour of wheat, honey, milk. You know, just the basics, and the blood of the grape, and oil. And this devil, when you read the uh, curse, uh, the uh, blessings of Esau, Edom, he has fat, the fatness of the earth. When you go into the word fatness, okay, it goes into the word oil and clothing. Yeah, this devil has, you know, added uh, extra materials. You know, um, you, you might you might think you have a shirt that says 100% cotton, 100% of, okay, uh, or polyester, but now this devil has a. Uh, broken the laws of the heavenly father and he has okay you know added three four other layers and according to the scriptures that that's going off that's why it tells you here in verse 27 all these things are for good to the godly so to the sinners are they churned into evil so esau has turned everything upside down man you see and another example of turning things upside down is taking the uh the uh, money Okay, from a lot of you Israelites and uh, transferring them to the new digital system without your consent. So, hey, with that, just a quick update. Um, Bank of America, customer anxiety and test runs for new digital system. Hey, and, and stay on your watch because, uh, you know, more test runs are coming. Okay, so you might be a brother or sister that might wake up one morning and then you see your bank account is and is that negative. Uh, okay, uh, negative such and such. Okay, you might be missing, you know, uh, you know, a few a few dollars, a few hundred dollars, a few thousands of dollars. You just never know with this devil, so you gotta stay, you gotta stay put. It tells you that in the book of Saint Right, never trust an enemy. So you know, walk with wisdom to them that are with that. With that, I want to say shalom.